possible for Smalley as well in the Duckham's car to get through. Theo Edgerton there, the reigning Sprint Cup uh, champion for Oops. Cayman's Own. We've had Loggy and Rice off. So two cars off, the big dust storm, as those AMs that were squabbling have come to grief. Ian Loggy tries to get going. I don't think Nigel Rice's car is going to get going again by the look of it. So it's a great shame that that battle has ended up in a, an incident between the two of them. So you've got Ian Loggy trying to rejoin. Here are the race leaders and Gus Burton then ahead of Keen Jewis and Nigel Rice with a lot of damage. That looks like it's gone over because the rear wing has been ripped off and the car is not going to move. So this looks like it's going to be a safety car. And uh, let's have a look at exactly what happened. He was having that battle with Ian Loggy. So he gets it wrong coming into the first part of the S's. That gives Ian Loggy a chance to challenge on the inside heading into Bombhole. Nigel Rice leaves the door open, then comes across, makes contact, goes over once, and a sort of corkscrew effect as well. So two or three big jarring impacts in that. Very spectacular. Another angle, Tim. Yeah, I mean, he, he made a, a mess of it and should have probably expected um, Ian Loggy to come up the inside, but the contact was very early in the corner on the right rear tyre. So, I mean, he, uh, Nigel Rice hadn't scrubbed off any speed, so that ended up in a high-speed jarring roll. That was really quite nasty to watch. These two have been having a, a good race. This was a mistake from Rice turning through the left-hand part of Brundle, which made him slow coming out of Nelson. Um, Loggy, in fairness, gets a good run and probably would have expected a bit of room and whether Nigel just didn't see him coming or whatever but that was a nasty the ground is like concrete here and that you could see from Nigel when he got out of the car he's uh, he jarred his back but he's out of the car but uh, at 65 years of age um, Nigel didn't really want to be doing that I'm sure Safety car will be in this time, and while they have been accelerating up to the restart, a mistake made by Will Martin, who has run wide and cost himself a place. Now, technically, you can't overtake under the safety.